My boyfriend Craig is very handsome. It took me about two to three months and I was completely in love with him. And that's Craig. He said, hope you're having a great day. I said, yes dear, hope you are also. <laughs> I've been giving him money to get his inheritance. He just asked me last night for $2,500 more dollars. Francis sent her money. I said, Francis, you're crazy. You believe Fran's getting conned? Yes, definitely. You believe this is a catfish, somebody's scamming her? Yes. You've talked to her about this. Yeah. Herman? I've told her it's not real. I said, Fran, you're being scammed, honey. He said we were going to get married, and I bought these little classes. They say the final fling before the bling. And I still have his uh, Valentine's card that I bought. Last night, he sent me a picture where he just had got home. Uh, this is the picture that I got from him. If he isn't lying to me, that would make my heart burst wide open. I sold my truck to my son. I sold my living room furniture. I sell these masks online. I sell my cookies. He's sweet and kind when you're paying him money, but yeah. when you don't, he threatens you, rejects you. Isn't that the truth? Never thought of it like that. We were able to find the man in the Craig photos. Thank you for joining us. Anthony, are you there? Yeah, hi, Dr. Phil. So let me be very clear. You're seeing your yes. Craig, right? Yes, it is. And let me tell you, he has absolutely nothing to do with this whatsoever. I am the man in the photos, but I have not been speaking with you at all. I'm sorry. What does this tell you now? Do you have any doubts whatsoever? It tells me I'm deleting everything and moving on with my life the best I can. Yeah. This is Craig right here and up here. Delete. Delete. Craig is deleted out of my life. He's gone. Was she able to find love offline and move on from Craig for good? Well, take a look. After the show, Dr. Phil had proved to me, without a shadow of a doubt, that Craig was a scammer. I did meet a guy just a few weeks after I got home that contacted me on social media. Dolan was an oil rigger, and he told me he needed money for a life vest. He not only needed one life vest, he needed two life vests, and they were $150 each. I was very close to sending Dolan the money, but the red flags were just there when I just deleted everything. Then I had a strange number popped up. I asked who it was, and he said, it's Chris. Well, you knew me as Craig. I don't know how he manipulated her again, but he did. He did admit he did not have an inheritance, that he took the money and bought a double wide trailer. Of course, then it wasn't long that he wanted money. So I sent him a total of $1,000. I said, Francis, you've got to be kidding me. You did not send that man money again. He told me that he lived in London and he needed a visa and $3,000 to get the visa. And that's when I deleted him and said, no, absolutely not and I haven't heard from him since. I am ashamed to face Dr. Phil and let him know that I was sucked back in by Craig. I've got someone else I'm talking to. His name is Daniel. When I was getting my hair done, he sent me a I miss you text. He doesn't ask for money, so that's a plus. Francis, you do know that Daniel is another scammer, correct? Hey, I'm sorry, I just totally disagree. She's looking for love in all the wrong places. I am definitely in giddy mode because Daniel has stolen my heart. Well, Fran is back with her sister, Faye. It's good to see you. Good to see you, Dr. How Phil. you doing? Good, well, thank you. You don't ever come on here being afraid to talk to me and tell me the truth about anything. You are always welcome, and I'm the least judgmental person you'll ever meet. Thank you. You do the best you can with what you have at the time, right? So don't be worried about telling me anything. Thank you. Now, having said that, what the hell are you thinking? <laughs> <laughs> You believed me when you were here before. I saw it in your eyes. When you uh, when you met the real gentleman, which was, wasn't he a nice guy? He was. To Anthony take time was out very of his nice. life to yes. come and tell you the truth? Yes. And just to remind everybody, when you met the real man, you said, okay, that's it, I'm done. You delete, 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 delete. You got rid of him, right? I did. And stayed away. I did, right here. Yep. And then you met this other guy. He wanted you to buy him some life jackets. Yes. Do you have a story or a question for me? Click the link in the description and tell me what in the world is going on.